Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everyone. I'm Dr. Kyunghwa Park, Chair of the Scientific Program Committee of the GBCC 10 Organizing Committee. Hello, everyone. I am Dr. Jung Eun Lee, Chair of the Scientific Program Committee of the GBCC 10 Organizing Committee. Today is the second day of GBCC 10. I hope you enjoyed yesterday's lectures. Well, you might feel a little unfamiliar with the new way of attending the conference, which is being held in a hybrid format. Today, I believe that you will perfectly get adjusted to this new normal caused by the COVID-19 pandemic and enjoy the conference more comfortably. I hope, really hope so. I do too. Now, let us give you a preview of today's program. Today's first plenary lecture is about will breast surgery be obsolete in the future, which will be given by Professor Monica Morrow of the Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center. I'm very curious how the futuristic subject would be dealt by a big shot like Dr. Morrow. Who is the second plenary speaker, jung -un? The second plenary speaker is Professor Emil Rutgers from the Netherlands Cancer Institute. He will give a lecture on breast cancer treatment. Escalation is good, de-escalation may be better. Well, escalation and de-escalation is now hot topics regarding breast cancer diagnosis as well as the treatment itself. In the medical oncologist field, ADP clinical trials and CREATE-X and Catherine clinical trial results it yeah, definitely resulted in de-escalation and escalation issues. And those kind of wave already covered by the surgeons. So I'm really looking forward to listening to Dr. Emil Rutger's excellent lecture. In addition, a variety of satellite symposiums will be taking place today. Right after this preview, Professor Stanley Seung So Hong from Celtion Healthcare will give a lecture about quality attribute of monoclonal antibody biosimilars, consistency and variation. And Professor Yen Shen Lu from National Taiwan University Hospital will give you a lecture about are all CDK46 inhibitors created equally. And Professor Nardia Harbeck from Munich University will give a lecture about continuing advance in metastatic breast cancer. Role of the new CDK46 inhibitors in metastatic breast cancer treatment around 1 o'clock in Korean time. And around 6 o'clock in Korean time, Professor Il Young Jung from Asam Medical Center will give a lecture about adjuvant ovarian function suppression in premenopausal breast cancer patients. Jung An, do you have any other sessions you'd like to recommend today? Yes, I have lots of other sessions to recommend, but if I have a difficulty to pick two or three, in the first early morning in Korean time, the panel discussion five, the title is Biologic Differences Between Asian and Western Breast Cancer Patients in Genomic Era. The title is very, very catching. And before noon, we have Symposium 4. The title is Adaptive Strategy for Local Regional Therapy after Neo Adjuvant Chemotherapy. And lastly, in the afternoon, there is Symposium 5 The Immunotherapy in Breast Cancer, Current and Future. And please don't forget to join the Running Challenges event during break times. To celebrate the GBCC 10th anniversary, we challenge to fill 10,000 kilometers together by doing physical activities like running, biking, and anything you like. The abundant prizes are waiting for you, those joining the challenges. Right, so make sure to join the sessions and events as well. I also began riding bicycles for GBCC 10. Hope you have a good day and healthy day as well. Have, Have a, a wonderful, wonderful second day, day of GBCC 10, 10 and, and see you tomorrow. tomorrow.